All right, hi everybody. Valkai and I twenty two yet again for a Titans of Darkness. Yo, Giganto Makia. Far more ridiculous. I I'm now I'm certain of it. I am certain. And Taro has been reading some Attack on Titan after this chapter. Yo, the guy who kept pestering me to review it. Yo, man, you're right. Yo, the hype is. Over 9,000. I, I want to see this shit anime. Yeah. I, 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 hey, do it, make it a movie out of it or something. Hey, Kentaro's doing... His main one is Berserk. Let them let them do this shit. Yeah, let them... I, I want to see an anime of this. I, I want to see an anime of this. She is awesome. But yeah, in this, this chapter pretty much... They end up fighting the other giant. Yo, they wrecked his shit. Yo, the Empire Giant was trash. He was trash, man, compared to... Um, I, what I found interesting was... Um, like, Prom said that Delos is... You know, the name, the name they gave the, the giant, I believe, was Gora. And... That's what he is. So essentially, it's not like one of those things, it's not like Attack on Titan. No, not at all. Um, Delos actually becomes the giant. That's what happens. He becomes the giant. Oh, shit. It was so epic. But yeah, essentially they fight the other giant. The giant from the... Uh, for the uh, Empire. And they just wrecked his shit. Oh my god. They just wrecked his shit. They call him Gora. Gora. And. Um, and you know. The, some of the. Of the. You know. The, the tribe. Are basically saying that. To think though. They enjoy. The. The divine protection of the giants. Um, and basically. The giant that. Delsk became. Was. 53 meters. Now, essentially, about, about, almost as tall as the Colossal Titan from Attack on Titan. Yo, that shit is ridiculous. Yo, listen. Listen. The things that just... Ah. Ah. I, I'm convinced. Shit on the Colossal Titan. I just said that. Yo, I just said that. I can't take it back. Yo, I can't take it back. For word. Well, for obvious. There are obvious reasons why I say that. Um, He's just so beast, Delos, in this, when he's in this giant farm. He is so beast. It is, it is un-freaking-believable, the things he does. But essentially what he does, he has these... um. It's not just on his arm, it's on his legs as well. These these pockets of like they're like jet things on his arms and legs. It's just but yeah, he's fifty three meters tall. Um and basically yeah, Prom says, You yourself are Gora, Delos. And he's like, I know that. And then he's bas she's basically telling him, you know, in accordance with the contact, contract, destroy the giant from Olympus. Commence. They, they, they. She says the name of the of the manga, Giganto Makia, and he just goes. He just goes on his way. Yeah, his arm, on his arm with these holes, and he was coming out of that arm. Like, I, th I think what, what she said was, what it was, was Nitro Nectar. I'm like, uh, that's flames. <laughs> Yo, it was flames. They were flames coming out of his fucking arm. <laughs> that was insane. And he just jetted it and it was going to hit the uh, other arm, the other giant. Uh, he rocked his shit. He rocked that other giant shit. Like, for real. Is his ignition. Oh, he just knocked the shit out of it. Yeah. It was so epic. It was so epic. He just knocks the shit out of it. 
And um, they're basically saying the Bletch's flame, the giant of fire, was sent flying. And basically, uh, the guy who fought um, Delos, to, who wrestled him, saying that is not a roar to intimidate us. It is a scream. It is screaming in pain. Um, and it, and on his legs, on his like, what was it? Not 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 the like the upper thigh, but below, like like your calf muscle. There are jets there too, and he's rising over the ground. Ah! That was so crazy. Oh my god. That was too much. Oh, man. Oh, uh, way OP. Way OP. I'm like, you got jets coming out of your leg, bottom of your legs, and you're rising up the ground? He would, he would annihilate, like, almost all the Titans in Attack on Titan. I'm not, I'm literally saying that. Yo, Katara pretty much, what he did in this manga... He took the Titan concept and just, 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 oh, just ran with it. He's gone. Yo, he's gone. He's just gone. <laughs> Yo, Katara. You're up. Yo, man. He's, oh, man. I have no words to say. He's basically rising up the ground. And he ends up hitting him again. He's, he fights the, uh. Other giant, he's just wow, wearing like a little a leg drop. I'm like, yo, what the hell? A leg drop, yo. And he just he makes it such part of the giant. His fire is strong. But the other, um, the giant of the empire obviously comes back um, to counter him. I uh, bring up these balls of fire. Yeah, these balls of fire that he attacks uh, Delos with. Um, there's actually no, it's superheated plasma. Supposedly, and then he brings out his fire, and they combat with each other, and um, and promo, uh, um, forgot her name already. <laughs> was so, so this show is this manga is too much. Uh, you know, prom. She basically um says, ask him why he dropped his guard. And he says, I can't do it here. And then she realizes that behind him is the, the, the villagers and stuff. Um, and basically she brings up the point of ceasing her life functions and everything. She will resume control of Gogler. And she's, he's like, I'm fine. No need. A wrestler takes in pain and turns it into explosive force. Yo! Uh, and, then, and then the other giant brings up this plasma blade. Plasma plate. I was like, yo, what's that? And basically, Prom's telling, telling uh, Delos, you know, you can't take a direct hit from that because it'll cut you in half in twain. So you can't, you can't. So it ends on having, yo, what he did, what he did to the giant, I was like, are you freaking kidding me? He grabs him. He lifts the giant up. And the other guy's like, that technique, he does a suplex. Yeah, what the fuck? He did a suplex on that thing. I'm like, you don't see that in Attack on Titan. Oh, shit. Too much. Too much. Too much for my innocent eyes to one watch. So now I'm forced to say this. Yo, Asayama. Miura's got your number, man. Just saying. <laughs> Yo, he's got his number. He's got his number. So basically, uh, you know, he, he slams him down with a suplex. And then it, he finishes, like, and it supposedly it crushes the, the Empire Giant's skull. Um, and I think, and he also says, you know, saying, you know, finishing move, carrying the feelings of those intimidated and threatened, exposed into action, as a skull of a giant caved in. And the next issue is, is supposed to be 43 pages. So, yeah. Ah! It's too much. Way too much. It's way too much. It's... It's too much. There's really nothing else I can say about... about this shit. There's nothing else I can say. 
probably now, by the way, for anyone who's wondering about the whole live streaming thing, I'm going to bring it back for Times of Darkness. I, uh, I figured I'd get these out of the way first. Then we'll go back to the live streaming. Um, and maybe we can get, like, you know, someone to can get most of these guys in and have a live stream. But, essentially, yo, let me tell you right now, this show. I, I, I am fairly convinced that Kintaro Miura has Asuyama's number. In fact, I would be surprised, yo, Asuyama starts reading some of he's like, what's this? He's like, this guy stole my shit! Like, no, he didn't. He just improved it! Ah! Unbelievable. I gotta give it, ah, oh man, I I'm speechless. Totally speechless. I'm convinced. And by the way, this gets a 5 out of 5 again. It's too much. Too much. Like I said before, this comes to the U.S., I'm buying it. Hey, it's probably only one book, one volume, but I'm still buying it. I'm still buying it. Because, oh man, you need to buy this. If this ever comes to here, it has people buy it. Just buy it. Just buy it. Come on. Just throw your money at the fucking screen and go buy this shit. Um I'm totally flabbergasted. This was a very, very, very well, dust there. Very good chapter. I can only imagine how it's gonna end. Uh, hopefully, and I'm wondering if it's really six chapters, because on manga here it says next one is 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 chapter seven. They didn't write that it's completed. I, I'm guessing it, it's completed because th that's what was that was what was stated in the in the news that he was going to do this six chapter thing, and then he was going to go back to berserk. And that's another thing I want to know. I did I mentioned it in the other review. Do you guys want to see him? Put this shit in Berserk. Listen, I think he should. I really, really do. I don't know where he's going to put it, but somewhere, Kintaro. Somewhere. Put this in Berserk. The Giants. I mean, he probably has already. I just I didn't just realize it. But put it in anyway. Yo! Unbelievable. Flaming jets coming out of his arm. Yo, like, ah! Yo, Colossal Titan, it's like, yeah, yeah. The Colossal Titan ain't got shit on those. Ain't got shit on them. Delos would destroy, like, I would say all of them. i go that far. i go that far. Um... Because they just... He's just too beastly. He is too beastly. Oh, shit. Damn. Just damn. Just damn. So, with that said, I think I'm going to end it here. Uh, I have nothing else to say. It's too epic. Yo, it's too epic. Uh, it's way too much. Um, Tell me what you guys think about this chapter. I'll probably upload these... I, I gotta take care of One Piece first, because I want to take care of that, and I guess I'll upload Bleach in One Piece. Then after that, I guess I'll try to um, upload these two. I got Toriko to do as well, but I'll take care of that probably later in, whenever. So, yeah. Oh, man, it's just... And my last thing I want to say, where the hell is King of Lightning... And Zoro fanboy. Are they not interested in this manga? Apparently they're not. All they're thinking about is Berserk. Well, yeah, that's true. Okay, everyone likes Berserk. I understand that. But the least you could do, the least you could do, is read these five chapters. And at least do a first impressions. Come on, man. I'm pulling it out there. George too. Like, for real. People who 
poor hangouts. Really? <laughs> You're hanging on this? Well, I think you should re uh, calibrate your brain cells because, come on, this shit is crack a lack -a. Yeah, I'll say crack a lack -a. I don't care. Because this was awesome. I, I can't, I, I just, oh, I want to reach out to six so bad, but then I have to review it. So, ah, don't feel like doing that right now. But I will get to it. It's the last chapter, I believe, as far as I know, it is of this, of this epic, oh my god. Epic manga. Freaking Kentaro, man. Like, are you going to go to Asuyama's house and give him tips? Yo, give him some tips. So, yeah. I'm Balkai and I tell you too. Titans of Darkness. This was awesome. I have nothing else to say. Um, Yeah, like I said in my other video, the other review, we'll try to do something... Um. Next week, Times of Darkness. Because hmm. we haven't done that much. Ages. Ages. So, got to do something. But look forward to that. I'm Bonkai Night 22. Holy shit. Too much. I'll see you guys later. Peace.